Karate, 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 karate. Karate. I think I'm really getting the hang of this. Okay, so uh, we're going to start class for those. Hey, we're going to probably start lots of classes, and that is to uh, deal with any issues, especially tech issues from the day before. And yeah, we, sh we sure had some yesterday. Um, if you were in one of my early classes, I had some audio issues uh, with the early Zoom calls. I, I found out why, um, and, uh, and it shouldn't be an issue anymore. Uh, if it is, please let me know in the chat, and uh, I'll see what I can do. But more importantly, uh, so yesterday's assignment was to send me a message through Schoology. And uh, uh, there were quite a few of you that you did exactly what I asked you to do, and I didn't get your message. Uh, but there were some of you that I, I watched you do exactly what I would expect you to do, and I didn't get the message. I thought perhaps it was because Schoology was getting overloaded or there was a lag time or something along those lines. Um, I was wrong. Here's the good news. We figured it out. There are two profiles of me on Schoology. I have no idea why, not even the slightest. Um, so how do you tell them apart? You want to send messages to the handsome devil in the leather jacket. That profile will get your messages. There's, uh, there's an, another imposter me. Um, he's, he's skinnier. He's got a little bit more hair and he's smiling because he's an idiot. Uh, don't send him messages. Never talk to him. He's useless. And uh, I don't have access to that account. Why don't I just delete him? Because I don't know how. Uh, I'm hoping to find out soon. And that's exactly what I will do. So I will go through and let you know um, who I have not gotten messages from. And uh, in order to fix that, what you want to do is you want to access, don't forget, handsome devil with the leather jacket. That's the profile you want to send messages to. If you go to our Schoology class on the left-hand side, you can click on members. I'll be right at the top and you can message me through there. That's how you easily find the, the Michael Serzinski that you're supposed to message. If you just go right to that envelope and do a search, it's the imposter me that shows up and I don't get those messages. Uh, and yeah, you're right. It sh that shouldn't be, but it is. We're working on it. At least we, but at least we know what the problem is. So that'll be the first thing that we need to deal with, and that will take care of level one. New stuff for today in our uh, continuation of becoming tech boo masters and climbing the tower. Level two, take a quiz. For level two in school G, uh, I, I put a quiz there. It has like, like a green looking puzzle piece on it. Uh, it's a pretty straightforward quiz. If you didn't study, I assure you it doesn't matter. But uh, answer the best you can. Uh, it's, a, it's a mixture of short answer and, and multiple choice. All we're um, There's a couple pieces of information um, that I am looking to get from that. But more importantly, this is to double check that I can get quizzes from you. Because if I can't do that, then I don't know what we're going to do. So that's level two. For level three, level three, submit a doc. Before you do this, you do have to do a little preparation. Uh, I, need to, I need you to make sure that your Google Drive is connected to Schoology. They have to be able to hang out and talk. In order to do this, up at the top of your Schoology page, you'll see where it says Resources. Click on it. Then on the left, it says Apps. Click on it. We're looking for the Google Drive Resource app. For some of you, it's already going to be connected, and you'll already be able to see the contents of your Google Drive in a big gold window. Uh, for others, you'll have to press some connect and approve and those kinds of things and grant permission and all that jazz. If you run into that, if you run into problems with it, ask. I've shown people how to do that a bazillion times. 
that'll get you ready for the next thing. For level three, I've included an assignment in Schoology. I've also included a link to a Google Doc. When you click that link, you'll be forced to make a copy of that Google Doc. On that Google Doc, there are some questions to answer and some other little doodads to do. Uh, but before you get to any of that, one thing you should do is change the name of it. Uh, I believe the doc is called TechFoo, but by the time you get it, it'll be called Copy of TechFoo. Go to the upper left-hand part of your screen where you can change the name of a Google Doc and at least get rid of the copy of part. Uh, if you don't, what you're going to end up doing is filling your Google Drive up with so many different docs that start with the same name, copy of. Eventually, you're going to be looking for an assignment and you're going you're gonna to be trudging through this swamp of copy ofs and it's going to be very difficult to find the one you're looking for. The other thing that I'm going to highly suggest, but not require, but oh, suggest that you do, make some new folders for this year in your Google Drive. Make an English 2020-2021 folder in your Google Drive. You know as well as I do, you have assignments from sixth grade or earlier hanging out in this thing. You're never going to use them again. They're just taking up space. Maybe maybe they have sentimental value. I get it. I get it. It's fine. Keep them, but don't let your work get lost in a sea of old documents. Make some new folders. Now, you will have to submit this Google Doc after you've done some writing on it. I can't show you how to do that because I don't have a student's Schoology screen. I only have the teacher version. So I'm going to have to talk you through it. And I got to be perfectly honest, since I haven't had a student submit a Google Doc from their Google Drive back to me, I don't remember all the steps off the top of my head. So what will happen is as soon as someone in the class is ready to go, I'll be able to look over their shoulder and I'll jot down all the steps. And then I will let everyone on the Zoom know through the chat the steps to take. And I will make sure everyone in the room knows the proper steps to take too. Now, this does mean that uh, you're not going to be able to skedaddle out of here maybe as quickly as some of you did yesterday. And I gave you permission. I'm not, I'm not complaining about it. But stick around to make sure you can get both level two and level three of your tech boo mastery assignments done. If you run into additional problems, let me know. The, the Zoom link is going to stay open for the duration of class, whether you're done or not. Or you can use the Schoology messaging tool. You know how that works. Just don't send it to imposter me. Remember, it's the handsome devil with the leather jacket. Uh, or, or you can just use your words and ask either in the chat or with the microphone. Or if we're in the same room, you know, just activate your vocal cords. It's pretty much how things still work. All right. So, uh Let's struggle with this. Karate, 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 karate. Karate.